So a very interesting uh, sector for, for us. So you've got onshore and offshore gas. So the onshore gas in, in central southern Mozambique um, had been uh, had been produced by Sasol now for more than 10 years and then they've established themselves quite well exporting gas to South Africa to their own facilities over there plus uh, y- you know um, you're selling gas gas in uh, in Mozambique and they're now investing quite a lot of money over two billion dollars to expand their gas um, production in in Pande Temane so so that is a great project um, with great prospects um, but then um, in the north in the Ravuma Basin you know bordering Tanzania there's some great gas great gas reserves um, you, you know so 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 E and I on area four will 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 hopefully put down or, or float a floating LNG um, and then an area one and area four combined the onshore but um, you know is still in balance whether that actually um, stays as reserves or will be developed in future by Anadarko and or ExxonMobil and or ENI. So that that piece, which will be the game changer for Mozambique, still pretty much in balance as we speak today.